Hey all, welcome back. Hey, I just wanted to do some uh, quick tips and tricks for Trans-Siberian Railway Simulator. Uh, this is the demo. Uh, I just wanted to show you some things I was kind of messing around and just playing around in this world. Uh, first up is going to be the Mafia Shop and how to get free weapons. Uh, so as you just saw, uh, what I do is buy a chainsaw at the store, or not the store, but the, uh, the car out of the back of the cars basically. Uh, what you want to do is head over to the Mafia shop with this chainsaw in hand. Uh, things are going to get a little brutal here in a second. Uh, what you're going to want to do is when you get to the Mafia shop, uh, you're going to want to equip the chainsaw and head on down. So let's just take a second and uh, see what happens right here. Like you can see, I'm adjusting my inventory really quick, taking a breather because this not going to be pretty. All right, chainsaw equipped to come in. They start talking like nothing's weird and goodbye. <laughs> um, so now with these uh, mafia shop owners dead, uh, everything's free in here. So go ahead and feel free to stock up. Um, and a nice thing as well is they actually drop uh, pistols that you can grab and there's pistol ammo for sale right there. Next up is going to be how to get free items at this uh, little, what would you say, like car shop. Uh, so what you're going to do is basically treat them like the mafia shop owners and just take them all out. Uh, while doing that, you're going to have to watch out someone from the railway on your right hand side or wherever you may be standing. It's going to come pop out and try to take you out with a pistol. Uh, so be aware of that and ready to take them out. Uh, from there, what you want to do is just kind of peek and uh, take them out one by one. If you expose yourself too much, uh, you're going to get about five bullets in the head immediately. So kind of peek, pop, peek, pop, peek, pop. Now that you took everybody out uh, at this car shop, all the items are free. Uh, for you to take, no one can stop you. Uh, you can just fill your bags uh, with whatever you'd like. These items are pretty cheap to begin with, so you shouldn't have to do this. Uh, this was kind of just showing some of the stuff you could do uh, if you're playing a crazy playthrough with no regards for human life. Another thing I wanted to show was uh, there's a building over here by the car shops, um, and inside of it is a log of sausage and a single mattress. Uh, the sausage itself is called the Dr. Sausage. Just a little weird thing I noticed, so I thought I'd show it off here. I actually grab it, uh, equip it, and eat it. Nothing special, though, about this item, just a thing to note. The last thing I want to show you is the radio inside of the train. Uh, this has been fun to mess with a little bit, a little bit of older style radio here. you got your AM, FM, and a tape cassette player. Uh, so you notice I turn it on, and you can actually tune the radio stations. There's no specific AM, FM. Uh, but you can tune it and try to find something to listen to. Uh, you're going to notice here in a second that uh, as you adjust the knobs, you might come across a radio station. Ah, beautiful music. And that seems to be it for the radio stations that I could find while messing with the radio itself. Now we're going to flip it over to tape and listen to what we're jamming out here. Notice you have a volume and a bass uh, slider on the front that you can mess with too. Uh, the fast forward works, uh, stop and rewind work as well. Uh, so feel free to mess with it a little bit and see what you can find. Well, that's it for me today and these little tips and tricks I wanted to show you. I appreciate you watching this video so much. Uh, please like and subscribe uh, for further content. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day.